Hello everyone, welcome again. Well, in this video, we are going to discuss how you can perform file upload action using Selenium WebDriver. So here, I am inside new bug detail page of Bugzilla. Here, we have an option of uploading a file. So if I click on browse, I will be prompted with a file upload dialog. Now again, in order to handle this dialog, I am going to take the help of auto IT. So I will create one more script for upload action. So inside this script, first of all, I create a variable which will act as a counter for us and a while loop which will do the job of polling. So in order to get the detail of this file upload dialog, I need to take the help of auto IT window or you can say finder tool of auto IT. So the title of this file upload dialog box is this. So again here one more variable and inside this I am going to store the return type of our win activate function and this will take the title of file upload dialog. So here I will put a slip and for 1000 millisecond and I will increment the count. Now inside this I will put a if condition based on the return type of this function. If I am able to find the file upload dialog this will return a non-zero value otherwise it will return a zero value. So I am going to put a condition and this should be 10. And end if. So first of all I need to bring the focus at this particular text box. So using this find finder tool, I will get the detail of this. So in order to bring the focus, I will use control focus. Here first of first argument will be the title that is the file upload comma and the component. So component we have edit and the instance is 1. After this I will sleep for 500 millisecond then again using control. So here I want to supply a uh, location of the file to get uploaded. So for that I will use control set text and this will again take the similar argument plus the location of the file. So let's say the location of the file will be this one. So this is the complete path for that file. And again I'm going to sleep for 500 millisecond and after this I am going to click on this open option sorry open button so if with the help of find finder tool so class is button so control click and this argument will be same And instead of edit, this time it will be your button. And after that, I am going to exit the loop. 
so compile it so let me remove this part so that I can test my script again compile it build it so we have already this dialog box with us so I'm going to run the script directly so as you can see that it has put that particular string or location of the file inside the text box so if I put this statement back and again do a compile build and if I do a run so as you can see that it has clicked on open also so now we are ready with our auto IT script and now I'm going to call this script with the help of our selenium script so first of all I need to navigate to this web page so inside the config.property I will specify this location after that in the same class I'm going to comment out this part so first of all I need to click on file a bug so I will do inspect element so here it will be it's a link so again link helper dot click link and this will be the link text so as soon as I click on it it is going to take me to the login page so inspect element so this is the ID so after this text box helper dot type ID and value will be this then similarly for password So if I do inspect element, so this is the ID for that text box. So again, text box, text box helper dot type locator and value will be welcome. After this, I need to click on login button. So button helper dot click. and the ID will be login so after login I need to click on add attachment so inspect element So here I am going to take the help of XPath. So again F12. Input at the rate value equal to this. So we have only one matching node. So here again button helper dot click 
and this will be the locator after that you need to click on browse button so again inspect element so id is data so button helper dot click and this will be the id and after this i am going to call our auto it script so runtime dot get runtime dot exe and location to our script file so this is the location and as we know that this is going to return us the object of process and p dot wait for it okay so i'm going to put a debug point over here and run this script in debug mode so it has opened the firefox browser and it has hit the debug point so if i do a step over first it will click on file a bug link that will take me to the login page here i will provide the credential and click on login then after that i will click on add attachment button and finally i will click on browse button so now i am going to trigger my auto it script so as you can see that it has executed our auto it script and you can see that file has been uploaded over here so in this manner by using the auto it script you can handle the file upload dialog and with the help of this statement you can call your auto it script so that's all for this video and thanks for watching